Hey Libra, thanks for tuning into my channel. Welcome to your weekly bonus love reading. Uh, this can be for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and it will be a six card spread. Having a look what cards come out for you in regards to matters of the heart. We'll have a look and see what's coming up for you uh, in regards to love. So, um, Libra, let's see. I'll, I'll be reading some reversals as well here, so we'll see what comes up for Libra. Okay, some of you have secrets or the past that's coming back in, or maybe even a Scorpio. The death card, there may be a major ending or even an ultimatum that could be presented around love, love and partnerships. Could be a past connection coming back in, um, and it's going to be completely unexpected. Page of Swords, you're coming up reverse with the swords here. Uh, you've got the blindfold on here. You may, you may be saying no to the past, or someone you've rejected or have blocked or said no to. Um, is coming back in. Um, okay, someone may want healing or forgiveness. You've got the star card. Could be an Aquarius here. You're coming up as reverse, though, as the King of Swords, Page of Swords. So King of Swords, uh, it could be that you're not thinking clearly about the past or you're not wanting to communicate. King of Swords very much rules communication. Um, and if this, if the Two of Swords is coming up, it could be that you're blocking Libra, um, you could be blocking someone from the past. They may be blocking you on social media. Maybe this is a lack of response, um, a lack of communication between the both of you. Um, and it could be very unexpected. It might take you by surprise. Again, it's, you know, it may be something that doesn't sit well with you or something that you lack confidence in. So some of you, uh, it could even be like a secret. Because the star can often indicate healing. The star can be related to things that are destined for us. So some of you might have a destined connection coming back. It could even be like a past life connection. Uh, the star card can also be like um, sharing something, exposing it, going exclusive, um, or people knowing about it, something being public knowledge or common knowledge. So there might be like I said, an exposure of a secret that you might share with someone or that they're going to share with you. And it could be something very sacred. We've got the moon here, so it's something that can induce anxiety. The moon can indicate the sign of cancer. So for some of you, it can be a cancer who's coming back um, or maybe uh, someone who is really sharing very intimate, emotional um, uh, information with you. So there could be a very intimate emotional moment or experience um, that could be very thought provoking um, this week. If it's not the past and if it's not secrets, um, it, like I said, it could be quite emotional. The death card, Scorpio, Scorpio is a water sign. The star card is ruled by Aquarius. Aquarius isn't a water sign, but it is um, symbolized by the water bearer. So there's a lot of ritualistic um, elements here, like purification elements. I want to make things right again. I want to remedy the situation. Um, but for some reason, you may not feel as confident in reviving the connection. Um, it could also be endings. So the death card can be breakups. It can be losing touch with someone. It can most certainly be going separate ways. Um, but it could be that you're in denial accepting this, this ending or this breakup Libra. And perhaps if it's not you, it could be the person that you're dealing with. They're not ready or willing to accept uh, what's happening in the connection. So they could very much be in denial about an ending. Um, it could even be like a heartbreak. So this week could could see some ups and, ups and downs um, in dealing with heartache or, or um, dissipating connections. But I often feel like the Two of Swords can either be like blocking something or being in denial about it. King of Swords normally comprehends things, um, analyzes them, understands them, looks at things that are very uh, intellectually critical way. But the fact that he was he's reversed here, Libra, this could be you or it could be an air sign you're dealing with, indicates that someone hasn't come to terms with something ending. Um, maybe it's uh, maybe it's someone that can't necessarily let go yet. Emotionally, they can't let go. They're trying to heal the star card. Um, you know, I often feel like the star card is the way we present ourselves and, you know, the stars are dazzling and they're beautiful and they're inspiring. And um, the way that someone is coming across isn't always what's going on, isn't always 
um, true as to what's going on internally. The moon, I feel, symbolizes subconscious and the death card can be things that are closed and, and behind closed doors here. So um, just know that maybe the way someone is presenting themselves, if it is perhaps following a breakup, uh, isn't always true to how they are truly feeling. And maybe they'll share this information with you this week. Maybe they won't. Uh, it, the It really depends. Obviously, situations are going to be very different. But there is an element of what someone is presenting isn't how they're truly feeling. I don't know if this is maybe like a coping mechanism, uh, Libra. This is the way someone feels like they need to cope with a situation. It could be that. It could be their way of coping with uh, what's going on between the both of you. Uh, but it's um, also denial or someone not ready to listen, not ready to listen, not ready to talk, trying to heal. So if there's lack of forgiveness, um, you know, Page of Swords, Page of Swords reverse looking to the death card is someone that doesn't have good memories of the past. I mean, they may be trying to move on. Seven of Pentacles, you can see her digging up the pentacles. This is planting what we sow. So I think they're trying to take active steps to eliminate the bad memories. But what they're left with, Libra, or the memories that you're left with, or the heartache that you may be experiencing, um, it's not, it's, it's having an upside down view of the past. You know, King of Swords reversed, Page of Swords reversed, uh, Two of Swords here, it's, it's bitter and it's sad and it's not feeling like we're left with very good memories. Um, potentially reopening of old wounds here, Libra, could be coming up for you this week. Um, whether this is intentional, whether this is you, or whether this is maybe someone from your past who is remembering these sorts of things could very much be the case here for you. I will leave your reading at that, Libra, so thank you again for tuning in.